Hello and welcome to the Drivers Hub. My name is Bhavneet Vaswani and if you're an OG on the channel, you might have heard me mention that the Renault Quid was my first ever car. It was a climber with an AMT gearbox and I used to take it everywhere from college to long arduous road trips with my mates and the Quid would take it all. It was a small, reliable, compact little fun hatch and I've always developed a soft spot for it because it showed me the freedom that comes with a car and also the love and joy for driving. And look at me now, this is my job. So today is the kind of day that I get to meet my ex after she's had a glow up. I'm here at PPS Banner Renault showroom and I'm just gonna check out the brand new Renault Quid. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the new and updated Renault Quid Climber. It is now BS6 Step 2 compliant and it comes with all new advanced safety tech. Want to know more? Let's find out. The Quid has always looked pretty young and sleek while maintaining the presence that you would get from an SUV with these squared off fender lines, body cladding all around and roof rails to make it look much more purposeful. You also get 184 mm of ground clearance and as you can see the car is pretty short and compact at just 3700 mm. Now, when it comes to looks, the sportiness comes from this raked dual tone finish right here in the end. And you also have dual tone multi-spoke wheel covers called flex wheels which look really nice. The front dual split headlamp setup looks really upmarket with the LED DRL on the top and the headlamp on the bottom. Now the headlamp has been made to look like a fog light to add purpose to the look. The grille right in front looks rather sleek but it's not that in your face. Moving on towards the bottom, the bottom part of the bumper has been coloured to match the body cladding all around the body. Moving on to the bonnet, you have two large bulges on each side to add some muscle to the car and add a sporty edge to it. Talking about the rear end of the Quid, the Quid looks really cute from the back end with these wraparound LED tail lights, an oh so subtle roofline crease that moves upwards to make it look like a spoiler and if you look at the bottom, you've got these diffuser-like designs right in the bottom, making it a really nice, sporty-looking back end. Now that we're talking about the rear end, let's talk about boot space. The Renault Quid comes with a very respectable 279 litres of boot space, but put your seats down and you get a whopping 620 litres of boot space. More than you need. I've always found the Quid to have a very minimalistic yet beautiful interior. The interior is rather robust and you also get a suite of new features like this 8-inch infotainment screen with Android Auto and Apple CarPlay, a fully digital LED instrument cluster, steering mounted audio controls and you also get quite a lot of safety features nowadays with ESP, uh, TPMS, you also have hill assist control in all AMT variants and you also get traction control as standard in every quid. This is a new initiative from Renault called Human First and I think that's a great campaign to get all of your cars to be standardized with safety features. When it comes to the seats, they're super plush and they're four-way adjustable in order for you to move any way you want. Now, when it comes to space, Renault decided to put the AMT knob right here, which I think is super genius because now that frees up a lot of space for you to be playing around with all of your devices, keeping your devices right here and charging them as you go. Just as if they knew that we were going to do that because the charging port is right next to that cubby hole. Let's talk about the engine, shall we? The Quid comes with a 999cc 3-cylinder SCE engine. SCE stands for Smart Control Efficiency. It's mated to either a manual gearbox with 5 speeds or a 5-speed Synchromesh AMT. The manual gearbox gives a fuel economy of 21 km per litre and the AMT gearbox gives 22 km per litre. Which if you ask me, as a city dweller, it's a fantastic number. Now, considering the dimensions of the car and the peppiness of the block, you can see how I fell in love with driving this little car. 
Moreover, even if the quid might be compact on the outside, it doesn't compromise on interior space. The rear seats are wide enough and tall enough for most people, and you can take four people and a boot full of luggage in the quid without any hassle. You also get stuff like a rear view parking camera to make parking even more easy. The quid comes in five different stylish colors moonlight silver, ice cool white, fiery red, outback bronze, and Zanskar blue. But if you opt for the climber, that being the super stylish variant, that comes in four different color options two that are monotone and two that are dual tone. Before we end this video, we want to give a shout out to PPS Renault Barnier for hosting us and letting us film the updated Quid Climber. PPS has the whole Renault lineup on their showroom floor and have some great people to show you around and guide you to purchase your next Renault car. Thank you so much for joining me at PPS Renault Barnier to explore the new and updated Quid. It has surely come a long way from my old Quid with new features and new design elements, but it still retains that youthful and sleek appearance blended with that SUV styling that I always loved. What are your thoughts on the new and updated Renault Quid? Let us know down in the comments down below. Stay subscribed and I'll see you guys in the next one.